How's it going, everyone? Welcome back. And today we're going to talk about the gray out problem for iMessages and the FaceTime on iPhone. So I took a screenshot of that. So you can see that my iMessage is actually gray out and I cannot turn it on. If you see the similar problems either with your FaceTime or the iMessages, you can follow the entire process to solve your problem. So without wasting any more time, let's go. The first thing that you guys really have to take a look at a few settings on your iPhone. First, make sure to turn up that low power mode and quickly after that, just go to your settings here and now all you want to do is just go ahead and open up your Apple ID, tap iCloud, tap see all here and make sure to enable the masses in iCloud. Make sure to turn this off on and similarly you have to do the same thing for your facetime as well called phone and facetime so make sure to turn these two option on your iphone now you want to go just back to the main settings and go to the general and you want to open up your iphone storage and similarly just like before you have to find out apps like facetime or iMessages, just come right here, select offload, tap upload app, and then tap reinstall app. And right after that, all you wanna do is just go ahead and restart your iPhone entirely, and now see whether it works or not. Let's say I've done everything as usual, but it's still not working on your device. Then the last work this guys can do, you can simply go back to your settings again, and here, just log out your Apple ID and lock it back on again. And see, if you see, well, you've just done doing the login and log out, still it's not working, then you can do this. You can go to the general, scroll down, and you can tap uh, software update. And if you found if there's new software updates, you'll update it. But if there's no software update, you can go back here, scroll down, select background app refresh, make sure to activate it with your Wi-Fi mobile data, and now go back again scroll down and tap transfer reset iphone tap reset and choose reset all settings don't worry this is not going to delete any of your personal data or information this will only change your wallpaper and it will disconnect your iphone with your wi-fi which you will have to reconnect it again other than that it's gonna not it's not going to delete any of your data so after following all of the process your problem is definitely going to be solved still if you guys have been requesting to ask please do let me know in the comment section see you guys around